What's up guys, Reefer NYC back with another video and today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. Um, just want to tell you a new product I'm going to be trying out. That's from Algae Barn. Um, just got my monthly pod shipment in. So we've got the Galaxy Pods right here. And we also got the Ocean Magic, which is the phytoplankton, which feeds the, the pods and also your tank. But also, uh, I saw a video on Algae Barn, um, them using sea lettuce instead of chato. Um, I've been using chato since forever. I still have chato in my tank. But I saw they started using sea lettuce. They said it sucks up a lot more nutrients. But also the main thing why I want to switch to it is because these are longer sheets. They don't, hopefully, I also want to test this. Hopefully they don't clog up your skimmer or get caught up in your skimmer. Um, like how chato does when it breaks apart and it gets all stringy and gets stuck into the impellers. But going to be testing it on my sump, um, not my sump, my refugium right there. Going to be placing these in there. We'll probably do some follow-up videos later on when I do my, my monthly updates. But first, I want to get these into my tank, see how it does, see how it floats compared to the Chato right there. I should pretty much, I should turn on the lights just to show you. Um, let me go ahead and do that first. I'll probably put this into the refugium, see how it does in there, if it floats, if it sinks, whatever. But next shot will be this inside the refugium with the lights on. Be right back. All right, so we're back. We have the Blaze Mini. This is the freshwater um, refugium light that they have. We have the lights on at full blast. Uh, as you can see, I have Dragon's Breath, that hasn't been doing too well. I don't know why. Um, it wasn't getting a lot of flow when I first had it here, but now I have it in lower flow. Just a little bit more flow, but a little bit lower. And then I have the Chato that just grows out of control. No matter what you do to it, it'll grow. And now we have the sea lettuce. Let's see how this works. Just gonna dump it in real quick. Hopefully it doesn't go through the, the grates that I have up here up here but i'm just dumping on this part first so, so that's the first one going to just dip it in here give a little swirl so it's a little opened up just dump it on top of the shake it out there shake 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 oh look at that pod huge pod in there holy smokes that is an algae barn pod whoa as you can see there, where'd it go? There it is, that little booger. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So free pod, I suppose, for the tank. Dump the rest in, empty can. Hopefully that pod came out too. Let's just make sure. Swirl, swirl, swirl. And let's put this in there. All right. So the sea lettuce is in there. I'm um, gonna open up this one since this one came out as a big clump. So it comes in pieces. As it grows, it grows into bigger clumps and pieces. And yeah, that's about it as far as the sea lettuce goes. This is good size. Um, if, you, if you've seen their video, it's like a long stringy piece, bigger than this, maybe three times longer than this. So this is a cool size to have. So we'll leave that there. Let's just open these up. These are more broken up strands. So yeah, it looks good. Some are flowing towards the bottom, which is fine. But otherwise, this is sea lettuce. Bigger strands. Looks good. So I guess they'll be floating for a bit once they settle in. But yeah, that's just you lettuce right there. Quick little video. I could probably give, do an update on how they perform within a month, if they've melted, if they've grown. But uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. But yeah, thanks guys for watching. Quick little video. Sea lettuce from Algae Barn. If you want 10% off of your order, use Reefer NYC coupon code, and you'll get 10% off the sea lettuce order or just anything on Algebarn. 
Go check them out. Appreciate all the love and support. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace.